Around 9.30 last night, a couple and their dog were out for a walk when they were suddenly attacked. A very rare scene for those who've called this neighborhood home for decades. It's crazy. Even if I was here for two years, it's crazy. Police say the attack was totally random. Unprovocably and without reason, uh, he pulled out a what we believe to be an edged weapon and began, began to stab our victim multiple times. Just heard a scream, went outside and, you know, didn't really see much other than the victim and his wife. The 47-year-old man was seriously hurt, but will be okay. His wife had minor injuries. The attacker ran off eastbound down John Street, leaving the man bleeding on the curb. People living in the neighborhood tell me that everybody kind of knows everybody. So when the stabbing took place last night, those who were out and about rushed in to help. We had a nurse that was walking her dog, mm. um, <clears throat> just happened to be walking up John Street when she heard the scream. So, you know, within seconds, we had a nurse on site too. Police say the man is white with a darker complexion, about 30 years old, standing around five foot four with a thin build. He has a pointy nose and was wearing a black hoodie and dark pants. Neighbors here are especially worried due to the nature of the attack. So that's a little worrisome, um, just again, because this is a high traffic area for people to walk their dogs at night. Mm. Um, a lot of people walk their dogs. The residents of Waterdown are expected to see a large police presence in the area. Uh, actually, police should be there now as well, canvassing the area for witnesses and any video surveillance. Police say the stabbing is not connected to the recent vandalism at the nearby Waterdown Union Cemetery.